Welcome to my Italian table at the Mudek restaurant in Milan. Today I will prepare for you one of my popular recipes from my menu in Milan, red beetroot risotto and gorgonzola cheese. Before to follow me in the kitchen for uh, the execution of the recipe, I will describe you the ingredients. Starting from here. Riso carnaroli, dop from Vercelli. Organic beetroot puree, made with a organic beetroot roasted in the oven. Butter from our mountain. Parmigiano Reggiano. It's important, do not translate the name. Parmigiano Reggiano is very jealous of uh, his name and uh, his quality too. Organic lemon, fresh and uh, liquid filtered. Fresh milk. Gorgonzola cheese and the fresh vegetables for our stock. For your uh, recipes, please choose the best ingredients and uh, better if uh, they will be from Italy and uh, DOP, from Protect Origin. Do not forget to send picture and movie about your recipes because the best one of you will uh, win a dinner to the Mudec in Milano in my restaurant. Here we are for prepare my risotto with beetroot and gorgonzola cheese. We can start to prepare our vegetable stock. We need the water really boiling and we add the vegetables cut in very small pieces. In this, if the water will boil a lot, maintain the vitamin very fresh. The freshness, the smell of the stock will be perfect in 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, our vegetables are uh, overcooked and the, the stock is now very good, very, the smell is perfect, the freshness is incredible, ready for use for our risotto. We can start now the recipe with the rice, without any fat. We can use maximum uh, some drops of butter for starting to cook the rice but we need the fat at the end for the creaminess of the risotto. First of all, we toast the rice. How long to toast the rice depends on the quality of the rice. Some rice very young, dried, need only one minute. Other rice, I prefer to toast two, three minutes. In this case, only one minute will be perfect. At this point we add the salt and the white wine. The wine gives to him also a great acidity and we will maintain the acidity until the end of the preparation. We wait the white wine will be completely dry We are now ready for add the vegetable stock. I love to cover completely the rice and permit to each rice to, to fly and swim around the vegetable stock. At the beginning the fire is high, then we need to maintain boiling the recipe but not too much. We can turn at the beginning and then we can mo don't move for 10 minutes. At the same time we are cooking risotto and vegetable stock is very fresh with his smell I'm very happy to, to have this on my nose. We prepare the sauce. We blend the milk, fresh milk, when the milk will boil, we will add the cheese and then we can maintain on the fire very slowly or in Ben Mary. When the fresh milk will boil, we will add the gorgonzola cheese inside and we stop the fire. At this point, 
we wait a few seconds and then we will maintain to Ben Mary for around five minutes and then we can filter it obtaining our gorgonzola sauce. The Ben Mary is very simple, water in a pan and the small pan with the gorgonzola cheese sauce inside. After five minutes, we can filter our sauce. And we will maintain in Ben Mary the sauce. I love risotto al dente. For this reason, we cook only 10, 11 minutes. We are now ready for mantecare. Mantecare means uh, the butter. And parmigiano reggiano. Remember, do not translate Parmigiano Reggiano saying Parmesan because the name is Parmigiano Reggiano. And some drops of uh, fresh organic lemon for give to the acidity, the freshness. We blend the ingredients, maintaining uh, a perfect creaminess around the rice. The amid of the rice are now in perfect combination with butter, parmigiano reggiano. Wow, the smell can have. Ready for a beetroot puree from organic beetroot roasted. Now the color will change a lot and became vintage. The crispness is perfect. We maintain hot on the fire for a few seconds and then we are ready for plating. We are ready for a plating risotto. The risotto needs to be hot and the portion is your choice. I love to be generous for my guests. enlarge the risotto in the plate and we complete with the gorgonzola cheese sauce in drops this way risotto with beetroot and gorgonzola cheese is now ready